Hi guys, welcome to Daddy and the Don. Today we're going to be previewing the West Ham versus Crystal Palace match this Saturday at 3pm. So before going on to this week's game, I'm just going to reflect on the game just gone at the weekend against Brentford. Obviously it finished 0-0, first home game, fans back in the stadium. Um, on reflection, a point was probably a fair result for both teams. Both didn't create too many clear-cut opportunities, probably like two or three apiece, both hit the woodwork. Um, both had the centre forwards miss clear headers when in prime position to score. So all in all, not too disappointed with the first two league games under Patrick. Um, looking at the League Cup, put a first team out, which I agreed to. I think it was the right thing to do. We've got new new players, especially at the back. They need to play together, get a system going, get used to playing with one another. But obviously the game itself, we were playing against the Watford reserve team, basically, or second string. And we dominated them at the start. Lots of corners, lots of shots on target. Created a lot, but we just could not score. And we let, let them stay in the game, let them stay in the game, and then we got punished at the end. So at the moment, it just seems like we're a bit of a limp dick at the moment. We're getting in the opportunities to score, can't put the ball in the back of the net. That's my issue going forward. I think the defence will be OK, but we need to score more goals. Obviously, moving on to West Ham, I think this is going to be a tricky one for us. They performed so well last year, just ran out of steam towards the end when they were trying to get into those um, top four positions, but had a really good season nonetheless. I think they've started off this season quite well as well. Had a fantastic turnaround against Newcastle after a shaky start and completely dominated Leicester. I know there was the red card, but... From what I was watching, they were pretty much all over them before that red card happened anyway, so I think they would have still won the game. But that's two fantastic performances already there. Four goals, both games. So we're going to have to turn up and be on it. We struggle to score at the moment at the best of times, so I can see this being a bit of a backs-to-the-wall job for us, and I think we're going to do well to get a point out of this game. So obviously, if I have to stick my neck out and put a score prediction in here, Obviously, as a fan, I really want Palace to get something out of this game and I'm hopeful that we can get a draw. But my realistic head is telling me we'll probably lose this game and I'm going to go for a 2-1 scoreline. So that's West Ham winning this one 2-1. Hopefully Palace can pick up some more points after the international break, even though there's a lot of hard fixtures coming straight after.